Well, today is World Teachers Day. Should be every day, right? Absolutely. And Connecticut has a lot of great teachers and paraprofessionals helping our kids in school every day. But only one can be named the 2023 Anne Marie Murphy Paraprofessional of the Year. It's a big honor. And we're introducing you to the winner, Donna Skew from Meriden's Transition Learning Center. Don, thank you so much for being with us. Thank you. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. This is a big honor. Yes. All right, so yeah. tell us, first of all, what does a paraprofessional do for those out there who may not know? Well, my job is to assist a teacher and helping our kids pretty much learn and cover her back and things that she may not be able to do like because of time constraints so my job is to fill in and help you're yeah. in the trenches mm -hmm. yes yeah, you, you're with the kids definitely yeah. I gotta yes. love it that's yes. great so what does your typical day look like uh, our kids go to have regular classes so mm -hmm. I'm helping with math and English and reading things like that gym class Oh, wow. uh, which is you do so, it all. because I'm a coach gym class is one of my favorite oh, things nice. I get down and dirty with the kids oh, I sweat so as much as they do so yeah I just get involved to totally tell us that about the awesome. competition did you know about it or was it just, you know did you have to apply for it or well just... I was nominated for okay it. not you get yes, nominated yes so I was nominated for pair of, of the year from Maloney High School and then I ended up winning it for Meriden and so then I had to fill out an uh, application to be nominated for the state so I was selected as a semifinalist, and after that interview, I got the call about two weeks later, and wow. I was very surprised. And you That's got $100,000 awesome. in cash. Yeah, I wish. Is that, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Is that your favorite part of the award? Yeah. <laughs> Definitely, <no. laughs> what, what is your favorite part of the award? Just being recognized for something that I was raised to do, mm -hmm. uh, just helping those that may not be able to help themselves. So I've been doing this since I was 23 years old, so 24 years. That is amazing. So more than half of my life. So just being able to do what I love and be recognized for it, and it's an honor to my city, my school, my family. Mm -hmm. Everybody. Uh, yes. Where were you born and raised? I was born in Ahoski, North Carolina. Moved oh, to Meriden wow. when I was five, so oh, I've been, oh, wow. I'm a Meriden boy, been here. You are, yeah. you're a yes. Connecticut native, yes. born and raised. Yeah, you might as well be, right? The mm -hmm. award is named after Anne Marie Murphy, uh, who was unfortunately killed in yes. the Sandy Hook. What, what does it mean to honor her legacy? I'm just hope I'm doing her proud. Like, mm -hmm. I, she, I know she was a hard worker, she cared about her kids, and I just wish she could know that I care about my kids as much as she did about hers. So I hope I'm doing her name justice. Yeah, you oh, certainly that's amazing. are. I mean, you know, the last few years haven't been easy for any teachers, for anybody in the school profession. Can you talk about a little bit what it means to be back in the schools and doing what you love? I mean, you know, it's been hard. Yeah, uh, it means a lot because a lot of our kids depend on us. They look for us to like help them with certain things they may not get at home. Mm -hmm. So being able to be in person, I think helps our kids a lot, especially throughout the day, just getting the necessary things. We, uh, we didn't have paraprofessionals when I was in school. We had a teacher, and that was it. And then every now and then, we'd have a sixth grader come to the first yeah. grade class, and they would help out. Yeah. But today, <laughs> thank God you're there, because yeah. right. I needed yeah. somebody else yeah. besides that teacher. You know right. what I'm saying? And we help kids right. not get lost in, like, in yeah. the mix, because back, like you said, we didn't have paraprofessionals. What are the age yeah. groups that you're with? Um, I'm in the high school, so ages oh, that's 14. That's 21. Okay. So, right. And yeah. that's a really, you know, it can be a really tough age for yeah. a lot of kids yeah. and they can, it can tend to get lost. So mm -hmm. it's so important to have people like you there, especially in these times. Yes. Look so. at these photos of you. You're adorable. I love it. <laughs> I love Look it. at that. You got your Maloney track and field. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh my God. So uh, you're going to continue on. Yes. And this wonderful profession. Yes. Helping our kids. And yes. we can't thank you enough for that. That's thank amazing. You. Thank, Thank you. you. And congratulations. Thank you. Yeah. That's excellent. And where are you going to go now? Disney World? Well, there's another ceremony in November, so oh. that first, then Disney. What is that? Is oh, then Disney. Disney. <laughs> then Disney. That's wonderful. Yes. So well, you deserve it. Thank you. It's yes. so nice to see you. Don. It was you. very nice to meet you. Thank you, you too. And good A luck pleasure. with the rest good of the luck. school year, yeah, too. Yeah, exactly. Thank, Thank you, you for luck. all you do. Thank you. Thank all you. All right.